exactly. We are a group of thought leaders who help take the burden off elected governments. We help set policy by drafting legislation so the politicians, they don't have to think about really difficult issues and instead have an advocacy group that does it for them. Really, I guess, Ron, you could say we're patriots. Ron, there are a lot of mistruths out oh, there. Oh, I'm not, I know that, I know. Yes. But I wake up every day to expose it. Yes, and that's Ron, and I said, American, I thank you for that. Listen, I, I know, I know. Okay. But, no. I, right, listen, Ron. No, I am listening to you. I am. Ron, okay, great. Why, you, no, wait, why do you think I'm not listening to you? I'm right here. So, I am Ron, listening. Okay. No, then, I then. am. I'm listening. Why do you, I'm listening. Yes, of course. Well, we, much like you, see ourselves as outsiders against the bubble. The government media expert bubble. Bursting the bubble. God, bubbles are for children to chase on a summer day. Or for a woman to spend hours popping those packing bubbles while drinking wine and cursing her newly ex-husband. You know what, Ron? <laughs> Let me put it to you like this. Do you think for one minute that the same people that lied to you about Santa Claus and the Easter Bunny aren't lying to you about climate change, Ron? Um, my parents! Mm -hmm. No! Yes, Mommy and Daddy were lying to you. They were buying into the BS. Ron, it's common sense. Climate changes every day. Damn. Hot in the middle of the day, cooler at night. This all balances out. There's nothing to worry about. We don't need to panic, America. It's going to be okay. Mainstream science and the mainstream media are two sides of the same coin, Ron. But you know what? I think the American people are smarter than that. They know when people are lying to them. Yeah, yes. See, scientists are wrong all the time. Yes. Yes, they're the worst. They are. Like, like when they say there's no sound in space, but then all of a sudden, I see the space movies and they're really loud. Everyone sees that. What does that mean? Okay, Ron. Uh, let's talk to the listeners for a second. I am going to Chill the fuck out. The science was wrong. They told us the Earth was flat. It is not. We know it's round. They said the pyramids were built by aliens. They said we would run out of oil by now, but it is cheaper than ever. Smoking. Did you know doctors used to say smoking was good for you? That's sort of how I feel about climate change. Y2K, people. Bullshit. I knew it. I knew Y2K was bullshit. Yeah. I knew that. They, they took... They told me that society was going to collapse, and it totally did not. Mm -hmm. I was ready. I still have a bunker left over. I, it's still full of macaroni and cheese and cigarettes and some hot dogs and some dog food, okay? I kept all that stuff for the wayfaring strangers that might appear every once in a while. Get away with it! My body, too. I would have. I thought fuck? about that. You're like a lot of Americans that did that, and I applaud you for that. 